Hello, my name is Robert Florence, a.k.a. Colliginous, or Colliginous, a.k.a. Robert Florence. It's all one and the same, and those intros are already getting old, and this is only the second video of this series from my inner musings. <sighs> you know, the things that just make life more interesting to live and enjoyable, loosens up the tension. Highly fucking important to me, instead of being a giant ball of rigor mortis. Walking rigor mortis. Hmm. Have a bit of that as a factory worker, currently. Hey, I embrace it. My choice, anyway. So, let me begin... In this wacky world full of twists and turns do we find out in this maze of craze is that it's all thought up thanks to imagination. Always in motion, thanks to imagining, making movements, where creation is continuously creating in its infinite self. Close the eyes and feel within to realize just how endlessly expansive you really fucking are. Just how really expansive you really are fucking are. Like the pulse of an ever-eternal heartbeat expanding its life-given radiance. All throughout the infinite. Those thoughts you have, those thoughts you give life to, and those thoughts you live by is an example of how your mind creates reality and how it's going within to be in the center with yourself to feel complete consciousness. Do you become aware of just how conditioned you are? So becoming aware while feeling the infinite being within that you are. Then, what will you give life to? What will you give life to while you're feeling the infinite being within that you are? That you give a concept to? Oh, what stories we follow and follow and tell the same thing every fucking day towards yourself. So, it's about taking time to look within. Basically, to look within and just take notice to what you're giving life to, a.k.a. your thoughts and feelings. Because to me, it's one and the same. Either your thought triggers a feeling or your, figure tr uh, your feeling triggers a thought. One and the same, so let the heart and mind connect and just feel it out and feel it out. So, the other thing, what will you give life, what will you give life to until you can feel it? And I mean, really feel it like a spark within has charged your heart space that covers you and covers you and covers your whole entire being until you feel one with it until you feel one with it oh to feel one with the desire just as you can feel the one within centered centered in for me it's my heart i center into my heart because it can give me great pain, it can give me great love. It just depends on how I want to clarify and classify it. It all starts at the center for me. So, I center in, and then just feel the infinite expansiveness of it. Yes, I feel it grow, just like the pulsing I was talking about earlier. Just feel it, and just feel it. Feel the infinite expansiveness all within you and how it affects and reflects all around you. When you tune in within yourself in such a relaxed manner and allow it to happen. Yes. Centering in and feeling. And how it reflects and affects. So, by that... For instance, happiness. 
<sighs> like the idea of coming up with this and being through this persona which feels natural and comfortable to me because it feels like me. And how it affected me, well, this collisionist feels like freedom completely. All my inspirations just brought out in all this expressive expansiveness, even my spirituality and how it reflects for me. While I'm doing this, I feel inspired to do this and it allowed me to connect with other like-minded people who feel just as free or looking for that freedom or can feel that freedom within now, that love, this, the common ground was Neville Goddard and now we take that new thought of which they call it and give our own definitions to it. That's all. Our own definitions to it. Just like how I see life. Just like how I see myself. Just like how I see others. It's all my interpretation. Hmm? And by that I mean like happiness. What makes you happy could be different from mine. But the feeling could be similar. For me it feels lighthearted and springy and... Ah, blossoming flower. So yes, hopefully that makes it as concrete. And I won't say hopefully, I will trust you will resonate with this. The more you reflect with it. And if you resonate with it, or you don't, may you find something that does. It's all about letting this lead and what you want to give life to. With the definitions, the concepts, and how you see things. <sighs> That's how I felt at one point. Now it's natural. And, and, I must thank someone for referring to me as Next Level, Next Level Neville. But I will add the unhinged part. So, I'm unhinged next level, Neville. That is a tongue twister. Holy shit. So, shout out to you, Melinda. Heart goes out to you. All oh, love and respect to Melinda. Thank you. Thank your uncle, too. Yeah. Cause he's the man. Got everything in his hands, including your heart, and I'm sure you got his. Yay! Happy, joy, love! Now go on and play with your own personal definitions.